Some people think that green screening is the height of technological advancement on YouTube, right? But you don't have to spend an arm and a leg to do green screening. It's what we talk about today. How to do green screen on YouTube. Here we go. Hello and welcome back to another video. If you're new around here and you're looking to start a YouTube channel, grow your YouTube channel, or push your brand out there onto the second largest search engine on the internet, click subscribe, start creating. Now we've all seen it, those weird videos where people are flying through the air like Superman, or a funny little thing, or they're running news articles in the background right, as a kind of swish background, or you're magically in a news studio when you're actually just sat in a desk in your basement in Greenwich. Green screens can be a great way to add that little bit of pizzazz to your videos or just make you stand out a little. But before we deep dive into how you can do green screening and more importantly on a budget, I want to know, have you ever tried green screening? Have you ever had any problems with green screening? Do you find that you prefer more blue screen for tone reasons? Or do you just give up because every time you've tried you've got that weird crackling bit in the bottom left and right hand corner and it's annoying and uh, I don't have time for that. Please leave a comment down below. Now green screening has been made famous over the years because people thought it would add that little bit of class and it is a quite cheap way to add some special effects. It's all you need. It's one of these. All you need to do is first of all pin up your green screen. Now this is a specific chroma green Right, but as long as it's consistent, then it doesn't matter what color it really is, as long as it doesn't clash with any of the clothes you are wearing or your skin tone. The reason it's green is green's obviously not a common skin tone, and it can be a, a color that's fairly neutral for most clothes. You can pin it up in the background. I've personally got a, a background holder, but you can pin it up on a wall, and then your core focus should be your lighting. Make sure that it's even, maybe try and get a light either side. If you want more tricks and tips on the equipment, I've actually got links down below for not only the green screen, but the lighting I use. I've also got a video up here explaining what my setup is, and you can see how I set up the lights, and you can kind of emulate that. Now, once you have set up your green screen, something like this, you may have a few wrinkles, but what you then do is go into your editing software, you click chroma, or in my case, I use Adobe Premiere Pro, so I use Ultra Key, and then you key out the background, and then all of a sudden you can put in anything you want. But the key thing you need to think about is the lighting and its consistency, because obviously the same green needs to be removed at the same time, but you can then do whatever you want. But these sheets can be fairly cheap, or you go to like a, a, a local sewing shop and you get something that's all of a similar green or a similar blue. Once again, you just key that color out instead. But remember, if green screen isn't your thing, you can always do what I do. This this is a freestanding background. You can link in the descriptions down below. I don't have a problem with keying this out. All I have to do is make sure that the lighting's okay, it's set up in an okay or similar place, and I record that way. So you don't have to go down the green screen route if you want a different background that isn't your bedroom. If you want to see my equipment set up, I've got a video up here. But that's how you can green screen on YouTube on a budget. For more tricks and tips, there's a free PDF up here in the description down below. Hit that subscribe button for regular YouTube tricks and tips videos. Hit that notification icon so you're alerted every time my video goes live immediately. Go out there, start creating.